Good morning, good day, and good evening. Today we'll make high-quality RCA signal cable that can be used to connect your subwoofer with cinema receiver or stereo amplifier. To make this cable, you'll need soldering kit with different tools and RCA plugs. You can choose them accordingly to your budget. They can cost from 50 cents to 20 or more dollars for one connector. And most important thing is signal cable. I chose Cordial SMK222 microphone cable with screen and two veins. This cable is flexible and has a nice price and performance. Before we start, make sure your chosen cable will fit your RCA jacks. It could be possible that cable is too thick. I'm going to make 3 meter long cable for my subwoofer. Making longer cable than 10 or 20 meters is not advisable, because it's an analog signal and there can be a loss of quality. If you really need a long cable, I suggest choosing larger cross-section veins. When length is chosen, cut off the cable and let's start making RCA to RCA interconnect audio cable. Yeehaw! Start with putting on RCA connector parts on both cable ends to avoid forgetting them on the table. Because after soldering RCA jack, putting on these details will be impossible. Then try on the plug to know how much cable should be cleaned. Then with a sharp paper knife carefully remove outer isolation to get to the veins that we will solder. But do this really carefully to avoid damaging the inner wires. Then twist together all wire screen weights by removing cable cloth threads. Cut off the threads because they will be useless. Then remove isolation from both conductor cores and twist them together to get larger cross section. And to improve resistance against quality loss if cable is being made longer. If cable doesn't fit in RCA connector, then stretch out a bigger place for it and try it on again. Then prepare the second end of the cable in the same way so we can get to the soldering as soon as possible. Cable ends should look like this before soldering. Warm up the soldering iron and cover veins with tin. As a result, each wire has two veins, screen and central signal vein. Then try on the cable and cut off the spare length. Cover the place where cable will be attached to the plug construction with tin. Then solder the central vein and then screen vein. But do it neatly. And here's RCA plug with soldered wires. Then press the cord into connector where it should be. Also install thermo tubing for extra durability. Screw together the RCA connector and one end is done. It looks so Gucci. Mwah! Then do the same to the other end so we can get RCA to RCA interconnect audio cable. Now let's do a quality check if everything is correct. Looks okay, like it should. And here's our 3 meter long high quality RCA to RCA interconnect audio cable for subwoofer, active speakers or DAC. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next DOI video. Ciao!